Hello everyone, this is Rehan and I am from Louis Bond. Today in this video, I am going to show you how you can create an amazing website using free tools like WordPress and like the free page builder called Elementor and free plugins and free images and many more things. Let me show you what we are going to cover in this tutorial. As you can see on the screen, we have an amazing premium website which I have made it from scratch. So we are going to create an amazing website with logo at the left hand side and menu at the right hand side. I can see these are the menu home about men's belt, men's jacket, women's jacket and the blog. So we are going to cover all these pages. I can click on this then we have a beautiful header where we have given our company name and below that people can get in contact then we have pages images more information description who we are what we do and the testimonials and below that we have footer and after that we are going to cover all pages our story we can add videos to the about us section and the client section what we work for and also we will see how to customize all these pages we will cover we will optimize our website to all devices like desktop tablet and the mobile because 70 to 90 percent our business comes from the mobile and further we will see we will create a beautiful header for called men's belt and we will design all these products how to put the description about the product and how to put prices and many more images and we will create all these pages from scratch also we will cover the motion effect side widgets slider to add buttons and at last we will see the block how we can create block page to our wordpress website we will see how to design all pages from scratch how to how to use as we all know that elementor is the best free page builder with the help of elementor we can design an amazing premium website we will see everything step by step we will be using all these section heading images text editor divider spacer gallery and many more elements almost all elements we will be using in this video so after watching this complete video I can assure you that you will become a pro web designer and you can start making website for other for the living and everything is very easy it's just a job of drag and drop so guys to create a beautiful like this you don't need to have any coding knowledge like HTML, CSS, Java and all that. You just need only knowledge, you just need to have how to drag mouse because all the all the sources are going to be free. One thing I want to clear you that to make a premium website like this we need two basic things. The first one is domain. The domain, the domain is nothing but it's your company name like google.com, youtube.com, facebook.com these all are domain name the second thing we need hosting hosting is a place it's just like a big computer which run by 24 by 7 it's very fast and all the images and these these words wordpress these all images text and everything what you see in this everything is stored in a file in a computer everything is stored in a computer all these background images all these things whatever you design in the website all things are stored in a computer and that computer is run 24 by 7 so once you register your company will be live and people can see your website and they can get in contact with you and you can generate the business so before making the website below the description of the video I have given a link just click on that link and start making website if you like what you see so far don't forget to subscribe my channel so that you will not miss the next upcoming video which is going to come very soon so let having said that let's get started the below video of this description section you will find this link you need to click on this and once you click on this you will be redirected to this page then click on get started if you are new you are making your first website you can go for this otherwise you can go for this click on buy now in this page 
you guys if you're already having your domain you can click on this and you can put your domain and if you are new if you are going to start your new business or new domain you need to click on this and here you need to type your company name so we are going to register it you can type and you can click on search it says it's available now go down billing cycle yeah it's amazing you are getting 60.50% off you can select the billing cycle you want to try for one month or three month for six month it depends on you you can choose for trial basis for one month and you need to put your username then security pin like one two three four it should be in four digit and i can write my username l u i s luis mba and uh, i can enter my email id i can confirm email id i can put my first name my first name is luis my second name is mba so i'm not writing you need to type your own name it's just for tutorial company name if you have if you don't have no not an issue it's optional and phone number and address the country state zip code and finally you need to put your you need to decide the payment type are you going to pay by credit card or debit card or you can pay by paypal as well you can pay by credit card name on the card credit card number cvv code which is the back side of your credit card or debit card then expiry date on the front side of your debit card or credit card uh this thing is not necessary then you need to tick on this you can untick this because we are new we don't need all these things once we generate the business then in future we require all those things that will tell you later on and finally this is your money back guarantee option also is there if you don't like the services you can quit it and your total amount is for this first month okay so guys once you click on this you need to click on this and once you make the payment you will be getting a mail and where you will be getting in that mail you will be getting very important information that is your username and your password for control panel okay so this so this is your control panel you need to click on this and once you click on this you need to enter your login name and password which is on your mail and then click on login and once you click on login you need to come down and you need to search for wordpress this is our wordpress we are going to make our website in wordpress which is very quite easy you don't need to have any prior knowledge you don't need to have any coding knowledge this is going to help you really awesome then click on install and here you can here you need to choose your domain make sure cancel this one it should be empty in directory it should be empty and this is your domain you need to choose protocol you can choose https okay because this is this is secure okay you can see this lock so you can choose https or you can choose http and here you need to enter your domain name okay then my blog your site name you can enter your site name and site description tell something about your site so my site is about interior my site name is luis 
and my site description is um, e-commerce tutorial this is tutorial you can enter your own then you need to enter your admin and you need to remember it because later on we are going to use this username and password so I'm putting you can put your own username I'm putting password here you need to enter your mail ID so whatever mails will be there you will be getting on that mail ID then just click on install once you click on so once you click on install you will get after installation your wordpress will be installed and you will be getting a mail you will be getting a mail from installation installator and you will be getting a, these two things your url and your admin so you need you need to click on this wordpress admin once you, once you click uh, on install button you will be getting a mail what mail id you have entered from wordpress and here you need to enter your mail id and password then then login let me close all this because I like to work in a clean environment so let me clean all these things okay so once you log in to the dashboard of WordPress so this is your WordPress dashboard from where you are we are going to control our website and we are going to design our website okay now let me tell you one thing very important thing when you click this is your site name and uh, when you hover on this you will find this so you need to click on the right side and open in new tab ok so this is your dashboard this is your back end and this is your front end here nothing is there it's very plain so we are going to design our site you don't need, you don't need to be worried because it is going to be very, e very easy it's very simple it's just a job of drag and drop I don't need this I can cancel this so first of all what we have to do we have to go to setting in the setting we need to go to permalinks then in the permalinks we need to click on post then save changes then go to appearance you click on theme click on add new then search for Astra this is Astra theme I have already installed then after the installation you need to click on install then you need to click on activate ok these are the images which I have collected from the internet so these things are already in my computer so you don't need to be worried then we can add new images then we have pages so this we call pages in pages we can add as many as pages we want to our website all pages we can see and we can view from here and here we can view add new pages then we have comment section so whenever any visitors they are coming to our website they can we can allow them allow them to comment on blog post or anything whichever they want to comment then we have this is called this is one of the best page builder elementor so i have already uh, installed it but uh, i will tell you later on about this we will see later on then we can this we call template we can import the template and we can save the template in the appearance section we will see themes we have ready made themes theme is basic basically uh, the, these are designed by uh, expert engineer software engineer they are already uh, designed and we can also design themes basically it it gives a, a look our website look can be changes we can give a different look to our website with the help of themes we can customize the theme we can create the theme we can add widget and we can add menus then we have users all users add new users you can view our profile in the settings we have general writing reading discussion media permalinks privacy collapse that means we can collapse it now let me click on dashboard so this area we will see step by step everything and it is going to be very easy now let me see what is there over here here 
it's written howdy Luis my name my real name is Rehan and this is my nickname people call me Luis because my company name is Luis Bond you can log out we can log in from here so when I click on this this is this is profile personal information visual editor disable the visual editor when writing we can click or but we don't need this is also not required admin color this is for our reference we can change the appearance and the look of the backend this whole area is our backend from here we are going to design our website with the help of all these things okay? so just I'm I'm telling everything step by step so that you will come to know that what is there in this okay so these are the color option like blue now we can see color have changed over here then we have coffee color ocean midnight sunrise this is just uh, does not matter does not matter okay I, I'll keep it I like this default if you like any other color you can keep it these things we don't require toolbar this we require name this is very important so my user I'm the user of this website so my username is Rehan my first name is Luis and make sure username cannot be changed okay this we can change first name is Luis last name is Bond and my nickname is Luis display name publicly as Luis click over there so you can keep your display name whatever you like contact information email is required over there so you need to enter your email id so you have to enter your working email id because any changes is there from the wordpress so they they are going to send you email or any update any information if they want to provide you they will send you on email here you can type your website if this is my website but if you have you can put but you can leave it not an issue because you are going to design your own website and you after watching this video i believe if you watch seriously complete video you will become a pro web designer you can start your own website and you can start your own business online and you can sell you can tell to the world that what you are doing and what you are going to sell or services you are offering you can tell to the whole world and they will get in contact with you and you can do the business you can generate good amount of money you don't need to work from 9 to 5 because if you're not if you are not an engineer you can become a web designer and you can become an engineer profile it does not matter account management under account management if you want to generate new password you can generate otherwise not required now click on update profile okay so after this what I want to do I want to take you now I can click on dashboard Achha, one thing one thing I wanted to clear this is when we hover over here we see this thing now right click on this and click open link a new tab now click on this so this is our website and this is our front end and this is our back end this dashboard this is our website okay so whenever we make any changes we can see immediately on this screen okay so let me close right now over this now click on setting then general first one is site title so my site title is today I'm going to design a website about another company so here here you have to write site title it is very very important because whenever customer or visitors they go on Google and they search for a particular product or service they type so they type they don't type Louis Bond because my, my company name is Louis Bond so nobody knows who is Louis Bond but what what Louis Bond is offering I'm offering leather jacket leather belt and leather bag so all the visitors all the customers they go on Google and they type leather jacket manufacturer or leather jacket leather belt leather bag like this so Google knows Google knows all these things so this this we call SEO search engine optimization so this is very very important site title because if you want to get customer then you have to be very careful while writing this thing okay tagline this is my tagline you can decide about your tagline because this is also very very important I'm just writing for the tutorial you can write but write which write something which relates to your business okay learn how to make premium website for free let me correct this spelling site address okay email address is fine membership anyone can register not quite new user default close subscriber quite date format you can choose the date format in Europe English people they prefer this thing so this is fine I do not like this type of dating but some other countries they prefer this type of dating and here you can customize also time format I would like to work 24 hours so this is because my website is going to work 24 by 7 and 365 
Friday so I will click on this and the week starts on Monday you can choose whichever you want because according to me in my opinion this is fine Monday to Saturday or the whole week now click on save changes okay so we have done with uh, we have finished general setting so under setting section we have finished general now we will see writing so click on writing in the writing settings default post category let it be like this we don't need we don't require all these things just keep as it is the reading blog post pages let it be like this discussion not so important media formal links this is very important thing first of all we have to click on plain then we need to click on post name because this thing is you can click custom text structure then post okay now click on save changes so now we have is privacy formal links media discussion reading writing general settings now let me take you click on appearance then click on now let's see how we have uh, uh, entered all these detail now let's see how our website looks so hover over this and right click open link in new tab so now our website is not looking very good there is nothing because we haven't we have not designed yet so we are going to design it and we are going to make premium website it looks very ugly because it's not looking beautiful so we are going to design it now we will go back to the back end you can go there by clicking over here our back end and this is our front end so these things are only visible to you because you are the owner of your website and you have logged and your visitors won't be able to see all these things okay so over here we have the dashboard now what i want to do first let me click on this dashboard i can close this so guys first of all i want to create some pages like home page where i can say about my company like about us where i can say about myself about my company who we are and what we manufacture what we provide services then about our product then our contact detail then blog post or anything so let's click pages when you hover or on pages you can click on add new you can do it from here also new and here it is page you can go back from here you can click on dashboard close this thing right now because i don't require i can close this so so guys i want to create some pages so what i'll do i can go i can go from here also i can click on add new or else i can go to this button and i can click on page so i want to create home page so let me type home make sure everything should be in capital okay so after this you just need to click on publish one more time publish and now home page is live i can view it from here this is the home page then i can go on this i can click on page now what what other pages i want to create i want to create about about us about me about my company okay so let me type about after this click on publish publish next page can go on this can click on this what are what are our services what are our product so i am going to offer men's belt you can type whatever services or whatever products you have you want to sell publish it again Next. men's jacket i want to sell men's jacket so i'm going to create men's jacket page publish it again then i want to sell women's jacket so what i'll do i'll go there i'll click on page and i will type women's jacket i can click on publish again publish and this time i want to create blog page where i can route write down blog publish publish i can go on new i can type i can uh, click on page this time i want to create contact page contact click on publish publish okay so after this what i want to do after this you need to click on menu so go to appearance click on menu so these are the pages which we have created add menu items menu structure this is main menu click on create menu you can give any name i am going to give menu name now create menu view all select all add to menu click on save menu so these are the pages which we have just created what i can do over here i can drag up and down see these are the pages but here it's custom link so i don't need this because this is by default i can remove it from here so how many pages we have 
we have uh, first I want to show home page see we can we can adjust it we can drag each item up and down and we can adjust it so at the very last I want to keep contact just bring bring your mouse over here and click hold it drag it down like this so this is my home page where and then about then blog I can drag blog down then we have our products men's belt men's jacket women's jacket blog now you need to click on this then save menu refresh bring your mouse over here visit site right click open link in new tab click on that this is the menu okay everything is fine home about men's belt men's jacket women's jacket blog so guys we have successfully created our menus and pages so i can close from this i can click over here and i can see all these our pages and this is our menu now click on customize here we have so many information by which we are going to design our header this is called our header this is breadcrumb and this is our footer so we will see everything step by step let me click on global typography click on base typography I can go back from here I can click on heading I can go back from here I can go back colors base colors text color these are our text these are our text so text color 545454 I think this text color is fine so I like this if you want to if you want to change other color you can change it from here now you can see the text color has been changed if you are keeping white it will not good look you can change the color whichever color you like you can choose and you can light like this or you can drag it up like this you can highlight like this but what I like I like five four five four five four five four. Normally, uh, in premium uh, kind of a website, this color is fine. So it's better for you also to keep as it is. Then theme color. You can choose theme color. Blue. I like blue link color select color I like green you can choose whichever you like link hover color see this this is this is link when I hover over here the color changes right so this is called link hover color theme color link color ok I think this color is fine because the background is white click on publish so we have seen text color can choose the color of text we can choose the color of theme and we can choose the link color this is called link when we click on link hover color 
this is link hover color so guys we have seen text color text color and theme color we can choose link color we can choose link hover color this we, when we hover on this this is hover color link hover color now we have background color select color you can choose red this this blue blue you can click here also light green there are so many colors you can choose as per your requirements but in in my opinion if you are creating a premium website the color the background color should be white because everything is it depends on you whichever you like but in my opinion what my experience and my knowledge it, it should be white we can click on this we can support the uh, image also select image from here you can edit the image you can crop the image but it does not matter that much let us back select just remove it it does not matter that part that does that does it does not matter that much this for a tutorial purpose i am uh, showing you everything step by step so that you will understand everything okay now i can go back from here i can go back from here then we have container this area is called container so it's with now you see this portion is this area is different and this area is different see that the gap you can see the gap over here and over here but i do not want to do mess up because what what is by default i think 1200 is correct but this is this is perfect do not change all these things layout let it be full with content but there are other options also full with stretch now this part is stretched this one also is stretched then we have boxed this area is in a box this is called boxed contain boxed this contain are in the box okay but in my opinion full with always keep full with content because this is fine because this much margin and this much margin is this is okay for a premium website page layout there are so many options but all the pages which we have created it should be according to me it should be in a box and blog post layout you can choose content full with content all these thing but it should be in boxed this archive layout let it be in boxed so publish don't forget to publish what changes you are doing over here
can go back I'm not going to change let it be like that so what we have to do right now now click on header go to site identity select logo this is my logo you can choose your own logo you can design your logo in logo maker go on google type logomaker.com on that you can design your company logo select you can crop the image i have already cropped so this is my logo here you can uh, click different logo but I don't want this different logo for mobile device no I am fine with this logo you can change the logo size see the, see the changes all the changes you will see immediately but I think this is perfect then we have site icon ok select image site icon is this part ok here you see it's B right now you can change your icons that we call site icon so my site icon is this select you can optimize this title is very important right click copy it's already there you can put here select copy image ok now here it is site icon from here you can change the image also but I do not want to change display site title no I do not want to display this part because one two three I don't want to show three things so what I'll do I'll deselect inline logo and site title I do not like I do not like both things together so I do not want this site tagline I do like okay so display site tagline I want to display site title not this this learn how to make premium website for free so this is our logo with two divider logo then we have menu I can click on this and I can see all these things together ok what else let me click on publish
so we have finished this part typography here we can change the typography I mean the size 15, 16, 18 like this we can change but according to me 15 is fine publish publish it again I can go back now go back so we have done site identity primary header primary header ok this is one layout this is and this logo is at the left and in this logo the center and in this menu menu at the right and logo at the left I like this style I don't like this style I want menu at the right and logo at the left ok header click on header primary header width does not matter bottom border size it's fine bottom border color bottom border color this is this is the primary header and its border so if you want to change you can change but I want I like gray color this is fine mobile header what is this that we will see later we can optimize our website to tablet this 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 is fine this is everything is okay and we can view on mobile also this is this is also fine I can go back from here in primary menu menu I can click on this I can disable the menu logo but I want that I don't want to last item in menu search button we can keep none we can keep search option button we can keep text but I like as it is container border container animations these are the animation in the container like uh, these are the container these things see I like fade let me click ok container border I can increase the size but let it be same as it is it was border color from here I can choose the border color these colors we can choose but I don't want ok then the divider color if you want you can change divider color but I don't want to change menu breakpoint you can increase this is our this is our menu we can increase or decrease this length but I like as it is 
menu label here I can type in capital ME menu label click on publish refresh so this is called menu label but I don't want like that I can check on tablet can check on mobile if you want if you like this you can take but according to me it does not matter some some companies they prefer but some companies they don't prefer but if you want you can keep it as it is I don't like this style toggle button style what is that let me check fill outline this is outline okay then minimal I like this drop down target that's okay click on publish back so we have done with site identity primary header primary menu transparent header desktop mobile desktop mobile bottom border size no we don't need this transparent on desktop we can have different logo for transparent header this is our header but that's okay I don't want bottom bottom border size okay let's check so this is the size bottom border size bottom border color there is no much difference so forget it colors and background just click on this select color it will be blue back I can go back so we have done with this header now we will see we have seen menus we will see home page setting block we will see block page we will see later sidebar single post they, these we will see later on go back then we have sidebar this we will see no sidebar no sidebar pages right sidebar these things we will see later on in this tutorial now what I want to do I want to go on footer footer visits okay top border color select color this is the border color that's fine but if you want to change you can change but I like gray little bit darker little bit light like this publish top model color okay top model size we can increase but let it be three colors and background click on this select color I want uh, green 
this color is fine for me maybe a little bit lighter publish background image click on select image select so you can see the background image if you want you can put but I don't want so I want to remove this ok content title color text color title color I want white and text color also I want white and when I hover link color I want blue for the bar this area is called footer bar and footer bar I want to remove this name of my company I don't want the motor and this I don't want this pipe icon that's perfect Louis Bond three this is click on publish I can go back go back widgets footer widget area 1 add widget so what I want to do next I want to add footer widget area 1 so what I want to add now click on add widget I can add all these widgets I can add image, gallery, custom, HTML, categories, calendar you can choose as per your requirements but according to me here my requirement is this text title I want to give it follow us just write contact person name after that what you have to do you have to first you uh, go on keyboard and press shift at the same time enter see the, the, you might be confused while you are making your website so be careful when after this I want to write down my mobile number so what I do when I when I enter it it goes it it goes two three inches down so I want to continue with uh, this so 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 finish the gap just first you press shift then enter at the same time shift then enter so it will be in the same same error line okay
So guys, this is how you can fill up your details about followers. Next we have photo visit area 2. So let me publish it and go back footer visit area 2 add a visit so what I want to add in the footer area visit area 2 this time I want to add gallery and title I want to say new arrival I want to save 4 items, that is sufficient I think. Or else I can add more. Click on add to gallery. Update gallery. This is okay in my opinion. The title. New arrival. So guys, we have done footer widget area 2. Now we will see footer widget area 3. To publish. I can go back footer widget area 3. Add a widget. This time what I want to show. See on the front page or uh, every photo page this this company is in leather industry so they manufacture so many products they do exports man, uh, they are manufacturer they are exporter they are retailer and wholesaler and one of the department they have corporate supplies that means all banks or other companies and hospitals or school institutions or government companies they supply bulk quantity like school bags college bags card holder luggage bags there are so many products caps t-shirts and all that they supply in bulk to corporate sector so this time I want to add text So whenever the visitors will see their website, so the buyer will say, hey, this guy is doing amazing because they have so many products and I like these products. It's beautiful. So the title will be promotional item. And in the text body, I'm going to mention all the products what we can supply to the corporate companies because it's a big market. So guys, these we call promotional items which they are big in demand in corporate sector. They, they will give the the buyer they give uh, regularly to the doctors like pharma pharma industries 
or in schools and colleges and in every sector almost everybody they provide all these things free to their staff to their distributor to their clients on a regular basis so this is a very big market What next? We have done footer widget area 3. Now we will see footer widget area 4. So let me click on publish. I can go back to footer widget area 4. Add a widget. What I want to show. Here, here I want to show something interesting by which the visitors can understand hey this guy is amazing what he is offering is amazing so they can get in contact with us custom HTML title the title is corporate gift items now I can add a widget one more so click on this gallery this time I want to add belt bags office bags insert gallery gallery I think this is much much better so guys now we have successfully created our footer widget area So till now we have done logo, the divider, menu and the tagline and in the menu we can see all these pages you can close this and this footer and footer bar Louis Pond If I go to first for you in this tutorial, you can click the here and if you like what you see so far, please like this video and feel free to subscribe for more upcoming video about WordPress and starting your own business and if you want to learn how to design premium website any kind of a website you can give comment below and you can discuss with me i will be giving tutorial on that thank you for watching this video god bless to all thanks a lot
design so to design our home page from scratch we will go back to our dashboard we can go from here or we can go from here also so this is our dashboard let me close this one thing i wanted to tell you which i forgot to tell you if you have not installed free astro theme you please go please click on appearance then on theme then click click on add new then over here type astra so this is the astra theme on which we are working and which we on which we are going to design this is totally free you don't need to pay anything so just install and activate once you install and activate you can see under theme you will find astra options and all that then after that click on plugin click on add new then search for free page builder which we call elementor you see the ranking it's more than 4 plus million active installation this page builder is amazing and it's totally free you do you don't need to pay anything and it's it is going to be very easy the most advanced front-end drag and drop page builder great high-end and premium websites you can make it from this just click on install now so the elementor page builder is going to be installed within a short period of time it may take one or two minutes depends on the speed of the internet connection so it's installed now click on activate so here it is now go to setting click on advanced make sure this thing should be enable enable and yes save changes after this what i want to do i'll go over there and i can go to my site by right clicking open a new tab i can click over there i can go to home page now click on edit with elementor so finally guys we have arrived at the elementor so finally guys we have arrived at elementor now what is elementor elementor is the free page builder which enables you to create beautiful website and also to optimize with all devices like pc desktop and mobile so let me show you how it works so how we can create something with the help of elementor what we can do we can click on this then we can see the structure this is one structure this is two column this is three column like that there are some kind of a structure where we can select all these structure with the help of help of this structure we can design our website okay if i click on this structure we can see this blue line the bl this this blue outline we call one section and in that one section we have one column that we can see with gray one so outside both sec outside the area we call one section and inside the area we have one column so elementor has three parts we work with these sections then we have these columns so we work with these sections then we have these columns and in that columns we have all these elements here at the left hand side we have can click on this and these are the elements like inner section heading text editor images videos button divider there are so many things that we are going to cover in this tutorial step by step so you don't need to be worried because it, it is going to be very simple it's just your about drag and drop right now at this moment we have chosen one section and in that section we have one column so what we can do we can click over here and just click hold and drag and leave it over here and here we can i can close this from over here like i can go back the plus icon i can i can select again and then i can right click and i can duplicate the column over here also I can right click, I can duplicate the column. So right now we have one section with blue, blue line and in that we have one column, two column and three column. Like that we can create three to four columns in that section. And here we can see this. We can reduce the size of the column. We can increase the size of the column. And, and I can go there. I can drag this element over here I can go back and I can drag this element over here and we can say this edit text editor I can click over here and I can duplicate so in one column we can duplicate the text we can I can click over here and I can see the settings for this section settings for this column so we are going to design with the help of all these elements and the section and the column and we are going to use all these elements step by steps so let's get started
mobile and tablet click update okay so this is our company and what we do and people can get contact with us now click on this this time I want to have three section in that where I want to show my three products to the visitors so I go over here and I can find all the elements over here let me see I want to go for an icon box so I click and I can drag it over here and I want to adjust it right now here I can choose icon library and also I can upload if you have anything in your computer downloaded from somewhere else the icon image you can find it from the Google and you can upload upload it from here which suits to according to your product or according to your services okay so I can click on this icon library it's just for tutorial so I can click on this I can click on insert change it stack frame but I like default and the title here I can put the title so the title is for the product over here we can uh, give some description about the product so that the visitors can read and they can understand what the product is, is about but I don't like this I update it let's have a look it's not just appealing to me there are so many options you can choose whichever you like but I'm just showing you okay then we have spacing so we have seen all these things now we will see content in the content we have text color I want it blue or maybe green you can choose whatever you like then we have typography this is ok then we have weight weight you can keep it 100 that means it's very slim and the higher you can have ok then we have transform uppercase 525 style normal decoration none line height none letter spacing none come update and then I want to show you show some few images how can I do that I can click on this I want to go for image I can search it search over here image carousel here it is I can drag it now I can add some images over here one thing I wanted to tell all of you whenever you are going to put images on the website so at that time you need to crop or you need to edit your image because the, all the image expect ratio should be 16 by 9 in, pi, in my opinion so that will be better the size for the beautiful for the premium website so while you are uploading your images the all image size should be in the spec ratio of 16 by 9 that will be better for your premium website because all the images should be in the same size so here I am going to select the image insert gallery so here it is the image size I can say medium large slash to show one image stretch yes navigation arrows and dot dots you can choose but I would say no the link media file light box yes caption none then we have additional option auto play yes pause on hover yes pause on interaction yes auto play speed maybe three three thousand infinite loop 
yes right fade slide yes speed okay direction left you can choose right or left click on update it might be it might be too fast so i could say one and a half second click on update and now i want to add a button over here let me change one image because i think this image is too big so i can edit it this i don't need because the size of this image is not the same if you click on update i want to add image now what I wanted to do, I want to add a button, so I'll click on this and here it is the button, so I can drag it below, so we are going to edit button section, so in the type I can say info and here I can write link, alignment, center, we, here we can add icon but if you want you can add but I don't want to add right now because not required not necessary here now click on style typography size 25 weight 400 or maybe 500 transform capitalize style decoration line height click on update click on hover and the text color is white that's fine no white clean background color blue text color let it be white yeah that's fine our animation shrink okay border type double I think none border radius box shadow there is so much options you can choose whichever you like position outline and this is so easy you can update so we press this edit button what I can do right now I hover over here and I can duplicate I can duplicate one more so these are total three columns these I don't need I can right click I can delete it right click I can delete this okay so in this way I have created three columns now I just need to change the icon and the title and the image I can click on this and I can choose icon insert and the title time I want to sell ladies jacket no this time I want to sell ladies jacket I want to change the image I can delete all these I can click on this and I can take this picture this picture this picture I can add create new gallery insert gallery okay in the same way i can edit this also here i want to sell leather bag this is the description now i can change the image gallery i can delete this and can click on this so where are the bags i want to sell this bag this this and this let me tell you very important things here from here you can crop the image you can make the picture perfect pixel perfect like 16 by 9 and you need to change the title always put a title in that title uh, like uh, visitors normally they go on google and they search for leather bag manufacturer leather jacket manufacturer leather jacket like that so 
whenever they type all these keywords and your photo will be visible and they will get in contact with you that we call SEO right click paste so you can generate business and you can optimize your website and people can contact you insert gallery oh it's great these are pure leather here you can put ship napa leather what leather is this everything but i do not like it's looking weird so how i can fix it i can click on this i can select one structure now let me close this can place click on this select three column drag it click and hold and drag this is how easy it is so now I want to put animation this time column so I click over here go to advance I click on motion effect entrance animation fade in up okay slow animation delay and I wanted the duration to be two second so the same I do it over here advance motion effect entrance animation fade in up slow update then the third one advance motion effect entrance animation fade in up and duration slow delay 25 now click on update let me start from here advance let me see how far I can go quite a bit I think so I can click over here on the icon box then I can click on advance then click on background click on classic and I'll make it white but I think this is not looking so nice so what I'll do I'll go to advance and the margin 10 is everywhere and padding also 10 so this this area is so this can be 5 this look much better Now I can now I can do same over here. So what I can do, I can so I will do the same over here. I'll click unlink the top thing as previous. So in the same way, on update, let's take a view. That's amazing, it's perfect. This is amazing, perfect. So guys, this is as easy as 1, 2, 3. I like it. I like it a lot. This is really amazing. But I don't like one thing. This area and this area, this area. I don't like the gap because here there is too much gap and here there is less gap. So how we can configure it? Let's do it. So let me close this. I go to the column, then advance. I uncheck this. So again, I will go to the minus. I'm sorry, it was not because I just want to increase the top margin. Let it be 100, and I think this is fine. No. I don't like it. If you want, you can keep the effect like this, but I don't like. And what is this? You can change the effect if you want to. I don't like it at all. There are a lot of other options also. There are a lot of options by which you can give design to your update. Oh, it's amazing, beautiful. I like it, I like it a lot. 
you can flip it you can bring to front I want to make it complete fantastic this is really amazing I like it I like it a lot okay so what next I want to do I want to add video over here how can I do that so to do that I can click on this so what next I want to do so we will check responsive mode on the mobile let's take a look so what next so I go for a new area I want to talk about I want to have one section touch the section and I want to change the height to minimum height I go to style and I want to add a background type classic I want to and I upload files position where we can focus center center maybe top center then I want to size cover in the layout I want to minimum height I go to style size to maybe cover center center let it be cover fixed that's fine so let's check how does it looks on tablet this is fine and on mobile I can say custom click on update so for every device you can make picture perfect I go back to desktop here we are so we have one column I want to make two color now I want to add heading so let's drag what we do okay then I go to the elements and I want to have one divider over here okay then I go to the settings of the column then style background type classic I can make it I go back search for text editor I can go to the history the mistake column style background I can make it white I can go to over here I can click on this and I can copy the text I can change the style text color maybe blue and uh, okay what I want to do I want to have small area over here where the background picture can be seen by our visitor so I can click on this then I can go to the sorry I can click on this then I can click on advance and at the right no click on this and here I can say okay I click on this see how it looks on tablet now I want to make this little bit transparent so I will go to the column settings a style in the background it is already white background but I want to make it a little bit transparent and now you can see through it update next I can click on this and I want to give one heading and I can drag heading and I can say testimonials I can break it I can bring it to the center go to the advance and I say margin typography now I, I want to you I'll go to go to there and I can break to this we can check this I can click on this style text color gray and column classic white that's look nice I can do more things I can go to the border border radius I can duplicate this and I can delete it now both are joint so click on this advanced margin and now I want to change this so I click over here 
so guys is the director let me decrease the size of the text so that's how we do what we can do the changes duplicate one more for the revision purpose i can go back from here I can click on this click on this click on this i can uh, click on this this is how what we do the revision what else we can do i can duplicate this area click on that and we can go on these pages and just now we have created a home page in that home page we have given beautiful do like and subscribe for the next upcoming video thanks a lot god bless so guys this is our dashboard and if i go to our site i can go there and right click open a new tab and here i can see this is the website which we are designing so this is our home page it's beautiful fantastic you can click on this i can click on about so we have just designed our about page now this time what i want to do i can click on this and i can click on men's belt so that i can design this page men's belt now click on edit page i can say edit with elementor so as we all know that elementor is the best page builder in the world with the help of elementor we can design any page it is very easy simple and all that i can click on this and i want to select one structure so here we see the blue line is the structure and inside the gray line is the column so we work with the structure and at the left hand side we can find these three dots if i click over here i can see all elements these all elements are free in elementor with the help of all elements we can create an amazing premium website so there are so many elements okay so let's get started to create our product page click on a stretch section then the content width i want it to be no column gap height i can say minimum height 250 i can click on update then i can click on style and the background color select the color from here say light blue I can click on background overlay if i want to put any image the back side of the background maybe this i can click on insert after this i can click on these nine icon click on this and hold for the time and i can drag this over here and the text heading type with title so now so the my title is leather belt so at the left hand side we find the type if i want to give a type the link and here you can type open a new window but i don't want to do that i'm fine with this size tml tag h2 i can say h1 alignment center update can go up and now i can style style so or maybe then we have typography 45 it's fine wait i can say transform uppercase style i am fine with this PC attachment fixed repeat and no repeat or maybe repeat X maybe repeat Y opposite so that heading should be clear update okay I want to do I want to add product not this I want to show four products so and search for image click on this and hold for the time and I can drag it over here and choose the image title this is for SEO the people when visitors they go on Google they search for they don't search search for these numbers they search for leather belt formal leather belt new leather belt black leather belt brown leather belt like that you can keep the title so i can say leather belt and below that i want to give some description about this product so i can click on this and search for text editor hold and drag over here what i want to do so this is my product and below that there is a description description about the product like what leather is whatever you know about the product type the description okay i can go over here and i can say button just click drag the button i can see the settings click over here i can type per piece give a link https say contact the tutorial purpose so i can copy all this copy so like this you can add more description about the product so friends here we can see our products and the price and we have given 
a link so anybody want to inquire or even anybody want to buy they can click on this they will be redirected to contact page and they can order from there click on update so let's take a look now what I want to do I want to show three more product over here so this is going to be very easy and very simple it it's a just drag and drop right click on the column and duplicate so the whole area is duplicate duplicate right click duplicate and this I can say right delete this one also I can say right click delete so in this way we have created four products now I can click on this image you can choose the image size when you can give caption if you want to add caption you can add caption and caption you can give media file I don't want to do that now click over here I can delete this image and I can choose the new image click on that this part is very important because whatever the title you will give make sure the title should related to your product so that when people will search they will be on the first page of the Google so I will say formal manufacturer exporter whatever your product is copy right click paste click on update and let's take a look so this is how you can add your product and this is your image some description about the product its price and we have given a link contact so people will come there and they will click on this so next what I want to do I can do so many things because there are so so many options to design your product now I will tell you a trick and in that trick what you can do just go there right click duplicate column and you can put other images can delete this choose the maybe this one so this is how easy it is I don't like because these are this is down this is up so what I can do duplicate 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 you can select four column just hold for the time and drag it to the box or to the column hold and drag it down delete click on update and everything is fine but I want to give some margin or padding over here because these things very close so what I can do I can click on this and I go to advance and there I can say 100 top and bottom or maybe 50 maybe 75 so we have got the space top and at the bottom update there are so many more things which you can do over on this right you can click on this on advanced motion effect and you can see or you can see fade in down click on click on update and I click I can click on this advanced motion effect I can say fade in left advanced motion effect fade in right advanced motion effect I can say fade in left for this one advanced motion effect you can say fade in left or fade in right if you don't like there is I can click on this and I can say slow animation delay slow slow and animation delay 1500 1.5 second update so I want to see the preview you can go there so there are a lot of things which you can do what I do let me tell you one very important thing which we have to do when our visitors normally all the customers they are having mobile and they search everything on Google on their mobile so nine I think according to in my opinion 90% or maybe 80% the business comes from the mobile devices so our website should be mobile response should be response so that when they open the mobile everything should be proper so let's check have a look logo is fine menu is fine I can click on the menu it's fine maybe I want to style the typography I can say the size is okay this is I can go to the content and alignment should be in the center now there is no no gap 
I want to give some gap over here so what I can do I can click on the and go to advanced padding okay that that's not an issue that's fine and here I can go to content center I did some mistake so whenever you find you did some mistakes you can go there so from here you can maybe click over here go to content enter, click on this go to content center go to content and maybe you want to fix the description so go to style update desktop now we will see how our website will look on tablet so i can click on tablet if you want to change you can change but i think everything is fine or maybe this heading click on this and i can say typography size so when your visitors will go on website they can if they are using tablet click on update you can close this and from here i can see the preview so guys this is how easy it is it's just drag and drop we have created our product page men's belt in a very simple and easy way if you like this information what you see so far please subscribe my channel youtube if you want to learn the whole complete elements elemental just go on youtube type louis bond and you can find two hours three hours video and you can learn and you can design your website it's very easy thank you very much god bless all of us so guys welcome back to the dashboard if i if i go to to the site i can click right and open a new tab i can click on the menu so just now we have designed men's belt now we will see men's jacket so click on that and i can go to edit page and i can say edit with elementor the as we all know elementor is the best page builder in the world with the help of elementor we can design anything any kind of a website we want so right now we are going to design product page or you can say services page i can say click then i can say one section so over here on the screen you can see this blue line this we call one section and in that section we have one column so we work with the section and at the left hand side we can see layout con content with i can say full or maybe boxed then column gap it's not necessary minimum height i can say so the minimum height should be 250 i can click on style for the section and i can say color you can choose the color whichever you want but right now i want to select light blue i can choose image i can upload it or i can select it from the library and always you need to put the title so that when your visitors search on the google they do not search for any company but they do search for leather jacket black leather jacket brown leather jacket like that you can give a title so over here and also over here click on insert media position i can say center center or custom attachment i can say fixed repeat i can say no repeat size i can say cover you can choose y position or you can say repeat x size or tone like that background overlay opacity click on update now I, I want to add a heading for men's jacket so how I can do that I can click on this this is the heading I will click on this and hold for the time 
you can click inside the column and I can delete the text and I can type men's jacket here if you want to give any link you can give but I don't want to do that and the size that's fine HTML tag to H2 and this will be center left center then I'll go to the style the style we can design the text color then we have typography in the typography we can change the size maybe 60 weight 700 transform uppercase size I can say 55 then style you can do normal italic oblique then we have decoration no I don't want to do underline line height letter spacing click on update maybe I can choose some other color I think this is ok let, let me show you something from the blocks pages or my templates so here you will find free blocks templates and so many things you can click on block so these are the ready-made blocks from here you can choose so many things let me show you about call to action clients contacts features let me check what is the in the feature click on insert here you can tell something about your strategy planning production management delivery and all that and here you will find at the left hand side content so what I want to do with the content here you can put your link I can go to the style section I can change the color blue or maybe this blue typography uppercase if you want to put some more text just go there copy I can justify I can click on this and here I can say latest so I'm not going to change all these headings if you want you can change as per your business requirement and you can say something about the design or the management or the whatever you like you can put and you can put some text also let me change the color I can go to the style and here I can select blue blue and over here I can go to the style and I can say blue so this is how you can change the content and you can change the text and all that click on update so we will see now go back what I want to do now I want to show my men's jacket so how I can do that I can click on this and I can select three column or maybe two column and here I can go here and from there I can select image choose image this is men's jacket title you can say black black men's jacket so anybody the visitors they don't search for the company maybe they sometimes if you do, they don't know about your company they may search about black leather jacket brown leather jacket so in the same way you have to be very careful while you are giving title right click copy click paste click on insert media image or you can say large click on update below that I want to say some descri description about the product so right now it's a jacket here I can write the quality of the leather the zipper quality and the lining quality and the color of the leather gauge of the leather so you have to be write you have to write 
description about your product so that visitors will come to know that yeah this is original quality it's made up of sheep leather or cow leather whatever the product description is there you need to write down so how you can do that just go there click and click on text editor hold it bring it down like that if you want to write more description just click here and start writing okay and below that I want to say price of the product so I can go there and I can select button hundred dollar per piece because it's original quality if you want to give any link you can give over here but I'm not going to do that and it should be in center now our text color are blue so here I can go to the style content style text color and to say blue or maybe white I can click on this and I don't want to describe more I can right click copy and I can say paste right now we have three column but I want to show four column so how we can do that I can I can delete this the blank one and even this one and I can right click duplicate right click duplicate right click duplicate now four four products are looking too weird so I can delete one right click delete I just want to show only three products because this thing is looking perfect in my opinion now I can click on this and from here I can choose the image if title is one nobody is going to search your leather jacket by one so what you can say this is brown color so you can say brown leather jacket so the customer and the visitors they go on google and they search black leather jacket brown leather jacket they do not search one two three select right click copy click right click paste insert media then you can click on this delete choose the image this one title select right click copy click so th what we can see over here just take a look this header is fine this section also is fine image are perfect but this is looking very weird so how we can fix that there are three buttons icons so I, I can select three column and I can click on this right click duplicate drag it duplicate and drag it over here right click you can delete this right click take a look now these things are aligned properly they are in the same row this picture let me show you one more thing this picture size is different this picture size is different and this picture size is different so there are three pictures and all the sizes are different so how we can fix that I can click on this and I can delete this then I go to so let's take a look okay this is fine click on update let's try something else I can click on this I can select two column and here I can go there and I can choose the image I can choose the image from here select maybe this one select right click copy right click paste and I can say insert media now click on this drag text editor 
select and type more description copy paste maybe more text right click so this is one column inside the column we have given image and this is one column in that we have given some description about this product what else I want to show I can go there uh, you can add video to add video all you have to do and find videos I can say Louis right click copy the link address so this is how you can add videos what else I want to add in this column I can click on this or maybe I can go there and I can add a button and here I can say get in contact get in touch I can say center I can style typography transform uppercase that's for that's fine what else I can show I want to show something over here so what I can do I can click on this I can drag the button and this time I can say click on update and let's take a look now see the distance over there but there is no so click on this go to advance and here give margin 75 or 50 so top 50 and this is the top 50 and bottom 50 click on this go to advance and I can say 50 top 50 and bottom 50 click on update now what else I want to do I can click on this and drag it up uh, I can leave over here and here I can say 75 click on update what's the changes you are doing at the same time if you finish your design you need to click on update so that it will save automatically I can reduce the text I can say control Z I can make it aligned like this I can click on this I can go to the style typography size let me show you something else this time just click on this three column I can go there image choose image maybe this one or this one insert make sure what's the picture you have it should be 16 by 9 so all the picture size will be the same okay so let me add uh, and I can add one button and here this time I can say you can type link contact alignment center click on update I can duplicate delete right click duplicate so in this way you can add I can drag it over here right click duplicate I can drag it over here but I don't like this style I can delete I can delete I can delete I can delete just I, ju I just want to show two image let's take a look okay I think the image size is too big so I can click on this I can delete or uh, maybe thumbnail maybe medium so in this way you can design your product I want to drag it down just click on this and give margin 50 
click on update so what else I want to show I can click on this and I can could I can stretch the section content full width and minimum height I can say reduce I can add background overlay blue I can go there I can click on this minimum height I can say or maybe 700 this is fine so this is how you can design and for this I can go to layout style background overlay and I can say blue light blue I'm not okay with this area so what I can do I can click on this tile I can delete this image men's jacket and text color maybe blue text color I can say white now let me tell you one very important things while we are design our website always optimize your website with the mobile device because everybody nowadays they use mobile and they want to buy anything they go on mobile itself I mean to say your picture and text and everything should be mobile friendly mobile responsive so that just take a look click on this and we'll see on mobile see it's looking weird so we have to correct it we have to configure this so I can go to the typography and size like this now it's looking perfect and I can click on this I can go to the typography the size so this is our logo and the menu I can click on menu and stack it like this strategy planning I can say style typography I can click on this and can go to the style text color white even on this text color white then don't forget to click on update now it's fine this is okay so in this way you can optimize your all devices like tablet mobile and desktop okay so guys in this way you can design your product page or service page so let's click on preview changes now it's here but you can change it I did some mistake so I can drag it over here so let's take a look super fine strategy planning management developing latest design people can come and get in contact with you and they can put the order so guys if you like what you see so far don't forget to go on youtube and search for Louis Pond and you'll find me this is me where I will well I, I give tutorial about how to make any kind of website like e-commerce website shop website social networking website any kind of website personal business and you can learn all wordpress tutorial and you don't need to pay anything you can design your website by yourself don't forget to click on subscribe button so that you will not miss the next upcoming video so this was the thank you very much for watching this video god bless to all of you thanks a lot so guys we are back once again on to the dashboard if you click on this click open in a new tab this is the website which we are designing right now now what else I want to add in this I can go to the menu 
and this time I want to design my product page that is women's jacket so I can click on this I can go there and I can edit the page and I want to design this page with Elementor so click on edit with Elementor so here it is Elementor as we all know that Elementor is the best page builder in the world with the help of Elementor we can customize our website in so many ways so let's get started so we are going to create a product page with the help of Elementor first of all I want to add an heading so I can click on this I can select one column or a structure and this blue line we can see these three things and inside outside is one column and inside is another column so how we can add heading first of all I can click on this and at the left hand side we can find these three items I can stretch the section content width if you want you can choose full width or boxed but I am ok with boxed column gap default height I can say minimum height column position middle this is the column which is in middle I can go to style and I can select a color click on color then we have background overlay background type choose I want maybe this one this is very important section where you need to type keywords which are searched by visitors on the Google they might search for leather jacket although they may search for ladies leather jacket so I can say ladies leather jacket copy my picture is not perfect so what I can do I can so this picture is not perfect I can make it perfect so I can click on this I can say center center go to layout and I can say height 2 I think that's perfect click on update can go to style so this is perfect now I want to put a heading over there so I can click on this on heading hold women's jacket if you want to give any link you can type choose as per your requirement italic bold ok this is perfect now what else I want to do this time I want to show my product that's ladies jacket I can come down and add two column and in that column I can go there image over here with this one see the title is dollar 86 but this is weird nobody will search like this normally all we test they search on Google something like that so this is keyword so when people will search women's jacket so your product will see on the Google first page click over here I want to disk some give some description about this product so how I can do that I can go there now I want to show the price of this jacket I can put the price here here you can you need to give a link so that when the visitors will see the image they will see the description about the product the size there is one more column so here click on update this is fine let me show you how you can add more more product or services in different so this is 225 but we have to optimize our product so that SEO 
SEO search engine optimization will work on our website so I can pure ladies pure leather jacket again I want to describe this product so so that visitors will contact and they will, they will redirect to contact page so they can contact immediately center that's fine the whole design will be duplicate and I don't want these two so right click so in this way we can add if you want to change the description you can click on this and start typing over here let me change few image I can click on this choose image maybe this one I can say this image is too short the image should be 16 by 9 let me show you how you can optimize how you can make pixel perfect and delete this choose image click on this and from here I can say edit image original size is this one but we do want we want to crop it we want to edit it so what we can how we can do that I can click on this and here I can say so so always crop your image in the selection I can say 16 by 9 the full no so this image size is different and this image size is different I can click on this and I want to delete because the image size is different so whenever you are uploading an image the image size make sure the image size should be aspect ratio of 16 by 9 so let me choose another image paste insert like this so the image should should be 16 by these two are attached with each other so I want to give some margin and padding and click on this I can go to advance over here also like padding I want to give some padding and margin over here so how I can do that I can click on this and here I think these are not aligned properly so how I can fix it for column duplicate 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 and okay. over here and make it aligned properly there is a there is no gap so I want to give some gap so again a style it's perfect there is, there is a gap between this and this so how I can fix it I can click on this and I can go to advance and I want to so I can say minus don't want to now I want to bring at the about side at the top side so I can and here we can find some ready-made templates or blocks go to style go light blue I can click on this style no right click just click on this and column color white I can click on this style so in this way you can add as number as products you want to your product page or service there are a lot of things which you can customize just practice customize do again and again if you like you can click on update and even after update also if you don't like any design anything you can delete it from here and you can start designing again by clicking over here let me tell you one more thing we need to always optimize our website with all devices so this is with desktop let me see on the mobile because our business <coughs> 75 to 80 percent business visitors they go on mobile and they search for products so this is looking weird here I can say content typography click on this style 
or background overlay I can click on this style typography now it's perfect click on update click on this we can see the menu this is fine tablet that's fine okay go back to the desktop let's take a look you can choose color option from here also click on update what else I want to do I can do so many things let me show you text shadow I can give blur horizontal vertical see this is called shadow click on update I can go to advanced most any fade time I can say fade in left like this animation duration I can say slow animation delay click on update click on this and I can go to advanced motion effect and here I can say two for tablet mobile and all that but right now I will show you these things you can apply on mobile device or tablet advanced motion effect go down there are a lot of option bounce in left fade in down you can click on this advance more side in right is slow I can click on this I, this time I want to check with zoom in right advance click on update for this I can go to advance motion effect there are so many options sliding up copy and here I can say paste style click on this can go to advanced motion effect and I can say it click on update so let's take a preview how we have designed it's perfect maybe I want to change the color you can go to style that's perfect click on update that's perfect it's also fine okay so this is how you can easily design your website with the help of element design your premium website by yourself you don't need to pay anything all elements everything is free if you like what you see so far don't forget to click on subscribe and also hit the bell icon so that you will not miss miss the next video which is going to come very soon god bless to all thanks a lot so this is our website and I can click on this I want to add in blog page to my WordPress website so how I can do that I can hover on this and click on page as we all know that blog plays a very important role in every website because with the help of blog we are every day we are creating a content so that we can generate more traffic on our website so click on publish publish so I want to create first post so I can go on this so before before creating our post let me add to the menu so go to appearance menu I can click on this then add to menu this one is invalid so I can remove and here it is the block I can save menu so after that I can go to post and here I can give it first my post so the title of the post is very important let me tell you I'll go on Google just like a visitor I can search on Google like top five leather jacket so these are the title so here you can see you will find the 10 best leather jacket for men leather jacket so these are the keywords which plays very important role in the blog section so while you are writing your title you have to be very careful okay so now you know what is the title over here and after this here we see this I can click on this 
and start typing so let me add some so just for the example i can copy all these te just dummy text for me for tutorial purpose here you need to write down your paragraph so this is one paragraph and this we call block paragraph i can click on this and if i want to add any image i can click on the image maybe this image i can select so now we have these things and the settings for this we can see at the right hand side we can see the width height and the title and if you want to give any link we can give it over here but i can publish publish let me add new post so i can click on post and here i need to type the title so this time title will be if you want to add more paragraph just click enter and here you will find so this is one paragraph this is another paragraph enter and start typing something like that so here we can see move we can move up and we can move down if i go there i can click on this and i can add more image and from here we can change the alignment click on that image it is the size like that and here i can move up something like this click on publish publish so in the same way you can add as many as paragraph and images let me add a video so this time you can click on post and i can say title right click paste let me add some i can say paste you can give link https or you can bold it italic click on plus and you can add youtube so let me add my youtube video if you want to more about blog wordpress website e-commerce website you can go on youtube and search i have a lot of tutorials about how to design wordpress website i can click on this and copy the link address go there right click paste it and embed so this is how you can add videos if you want to add some and now i want to add some more paragraph i can click on paragraph paste and here we have a drop cap so the first letter and we have color settings you can choose the color i can if we if i want to add other things i can add gallery video image audio so many things i can go down inline elements go down custom blocks and common blocks we have so many things over there which it's and all that let me add one more image or else i can reduce the size and here i can go up more up and down down up up so this is how we can 
and click on the image I can drag it and make the style this is how you can add block click on publish publish we can view view the post by clicking over view post so in this way we can add post and below that people can comment and these are the recent post we have added right now I can click on this now I want to design my contact page so I can click on that go to plugin add new and here at the right hand side in the search box I can search for contact form 7 and I can add new and here I can search contact form 7 click on before clicking you can check this one is very famous more than 5 million active installations are there I can click on install so the contact form 7 is going to install now click on activate so the contact form 7 is activated I can click on contact forms and here I can say edit So this is label your name and your email and the subject and the message body and at last we have sent in the email click on email and here you need to type your the domain email address and at the same time the same email address and rest of the thing will be the same then click on save in the message body there are so many options thank you well, thank you for your message it has been sent like this there are so many options out there but we will not change anything in the additional setting also we will keep it same I can click on save and then I can go to our page that is contact page and here I can say edit go to contact form copy this code copy go back update and now we can view the page okay this is how you can set up your contact page so your visitors will see all these things and they can send you an inquiry about their requirement like their name their email address subject and message you can design wordpress website now let's check right click open a new link right click and here we can see the website we have designed just now so this is our home page and then here it is the menu I can go to about page everything is perfect it is so easy it's just a drag and drop and with the help of Elementor and all that we have designed about a space now we will see men's belt superb and now we will see next page that is men's jacket all right amazing superb really great I like it I like it a lot now we can see next page women's jacket and you can have a look on blog
blog page is not visible right now so how we can fix it I can go on customize I can say on blog single post no I can go back global container I can close this and I can go to the dashboard and there in the setting I can go to reading in the reading home page is home page and the post page is blog click on save changes then I can go on my website refresh and now I can see this is our blog page beautiful so friends in this way if you want to design your own website and you don't want to pay to someone else you can do it below of the description of this video I have given a link click on that link and from there you can get your company registered register your domain and hosting and install WordPress and after that you can start design your website you don't need to have any prior knowledge because after watching this video I can assure you I can give you guarantee that you can create better than this because this is it's just a job of drag and drop if you like what you see so far don't forget to subscribe my channel and hit the bell icon so that you will not miss the next upcoming video thanks a lot god bless to all of us so guys this is our dashboard and if i go over here visit site i can do right click open in a new tab and I can see my website over here now what I want to do click on this click on about page this time I want to create my about page so how I can create it is going to be very easy just click on edit with Elementor Elementor is the best page builder in the world with the help of Elementor we can create any kind of website so right now we are going to create our about page with the help of Elementor page builder so at the left hand side we have all elements in a section heading image text video image box icon box there are so many testimonial toggle social icon alert then we can click on this and then we can see all WordPress elements, video, image, categories, recent ports, RSS, so many things. So we will use all these elements to create our home page. Now let me tell you one thing. You can click on this and from here we can select structure. I can click on this column. So you can see this is blue line and inside we have this gray column so on the blue line we have these three things so this is one section and inside the section we have column so we work with the section I can click on this and at the left hand side we will find these three things over here I can stretch the section so this area will be stretched or if you don't want to stretch you can click on here we have option content width full width or boxed or at the column gap we can choose the gap of the column of this then we have height height you can select fit to screen so this will be totally fit or you can choose minimum height so this is the height minimum height of the section if you want to make any design in this section you need to click on this and after that you can go to the style and at the style you can select classic then gradient you can add video you can add slide so I want to choose a color you can choose this if you want to put any image you can put 
for example I want to show this image select the image and you need to optimize your image just you need to type the title this title you need to type in such a way so that when people search they can search for leather jacket or leather belt or anything which you like which relates to your business that title you need to enter so I am writing title Lewis Bond if anybody search on the Google so this page will come copy all text right click paste insert media so we have got this image now we can position center center attachment fixed it's repeat so I'll say no repeat so like this you can add image background or else what you can do you can go to the background overlay background overlay you can choose gradient primary color blue and I can type or about our company size medium tag you can say S2 spine alignment center now I can go to style section and the style section I can choose color blue typography from here I can increase the size that's perfect I can choose weight and that is fine transform uppercase or normal decoration you can choose underline overline line throw there are so many options you can choose which you like I say none this is line height and this is letter spacing let's take a look okay so now you know you can can select so guys now you know you can select the structure one one column two column three column like that you can choose whichever structure you want to create I can close from this so now you know how you can add background image how you can add heading and how you can design all these typography <coughs> so now you know how you can use a structure and how you can choose how you can select this and how you can put the contact inside and how you can change the gradient color all those things you can do step by step now if you don't want to do all these things what I suggest to you if you want to save your time you go to add templates and here just type there are so many ready-made templates designed by experts so you don't need to design you just need to insert into your website these are the pro one but you don't need to worry because if you don't want to pay you can use free templates like this one is not pro this one is free just click on just take a look you can click on this and this is how I can see about a page now what I want to do I can close this I can click on this I'll go to the layout section and in the layout section I'll say minimum height then I can click and I can go to style section and I say choose the image I can select the image I can insert it then I go down and I can say background overlay and in the background overlay I can choose the color blue okay don't forget while you are making any changes don't forget to click on update what else I want to make changes in this so this is the main section in that section we have all these columns I can click over here the blue icon and we can see we can configure all these things icon library say for example I don't want to say Facebook but I do want to say show Instagram so I can click on this and I can type I can insert Instagram and here I can type instead of Facebook I can type Instagram change these texts but I don't want to change right now 
and I can give the link. like that you can put Instagram link so for example this is your Instagram link and copy and you can you can paste it like this so when people they go in a new window or you can no follow on update same way you can all things I'll go tiles and in the style section choose the color which is that you can this is how easy it is to grab this way can be explained to you so now you know how you can do when we people will click on about page about us something about some description about your company oh, what we do when you start playing. I want to change color of this go to the style color is fine typography little bit eight four and five and per tile normal decoration no structure color so go to the layout and call height of the column so top I want padding 25 Public blue see the settings for this our steady story tile section typograph say fifth can do like this click on update then go there I want to I want to write down more something about our company and myself so copy all this is how you can write the description about your company over here click on this here you can put a video to your of your company so what you have to do if you have any videos you can go there you can put say for example just go on to copy link and go back over oh, here I can all this so this is the video this is how you can add video link to your WordPress website if you want to, if, if you want to learn more about WordPress for beginners then go to YouTube and type Louis Bond you will find all this thing detail three hour video after watching this three hour video you can become a web designer and even you can become a pro web designer so friends click on update now these things are attached I want to give some margin so I can click on this I can go to advanced and here I can say top minus not plus ok not this one this I have done I want to edit this the section height minimum height custom I can click on this this we call image carousel which we have done earlier I don't want to show all these image I can delete it all click on delete then click on plus select the Im image create new gallery style or maybe content style color I say white I can click on this so these are our client for whom we work so what I can say I can put one heading over here how I can do that client we work for if you want to give any link you can give on center where I can style the heading text color typography these are our client so I want to or maybe I can click on this I can drag it above this or maybe so this is how you can drag it up and now we have to give margin over here because there is no margin at all and go to advanced to adjust the gap so I can click on this I can click on this and I can go to advanced so guys this, so this is how you can create your about us page it is very easy it's just a drag and drop what we did we import we insert a ready made template and after that we designed it in such a way it's very beautiful so let's take a look so this is our logo our menu and this is our about us page so what we did in this tutorial in the background we have added an image then we have given one blue gradient color and after that there is some description about our company and then we have social icons like this instagram heading and description then we have heading our story something about our client then we have added video then we have added client we work for now we saw how we can put heading and all that so guys this is how you can create your about us very simple and very easy and i believe anybody who knows how to drag and drop from the mouse make premium website very so what we did so far we have selected a section in that section we have given a heading style about this heading the divider and here we have column in that column we have text editor description about our company then we have gone through with the social icon and style again heading and something about our company and all that we learn how did we video again heading so now you can see how beautiful is this website now we will see how this website looks on mobile because 75% visitors come from mobile 
whatever they want to buy they everybody they have mobile and they go on google and they search for anything so 70 to 90 percent business comes from the web from the mobile so mobile visitors so it is very important that your website has to be mobile responsive so let's take a look we can click on this i can go on tablet you can see this logo is fine and this menu also is fine i can close this about us page okay client we work for i can click on this or maybe this go to the style and the style style i want to reduce the size so this is looking perfect i can make picture pixel perfect for all devices i can click on update go to mobile our website will look on mobile because from the mobile the business is going to come so our content and our image should be perfect it should look perfect so this logo and this is mobile friendly and this i can go to the style and i can see the typography i want to reduce the size i go to the style then typography and i want to click on update now i want to reduce the heading i can click on this and i can say now here i want to client we work for here i want to say typography client we work for now click on update now go to desktop and you can see the preview changes okay everything is fine thanks a lot for watching this video thank you